Hey, this is Matt from Den and DJ at the Gift Music Studios, and today I'm with the brand new Prime 4. The Prime 4 is a solution that many DJs have been asking for for a very long time. It is the world's first four-channel standalone unit. Not only does it serve as a fantastic tool for mobile DJs with some of the features we've implemented, it also serves as a great introduction to the Prime ecosystem. So the centerpiece of the Prime 4 is the 10-inch touchscreen. Now this is user adjustable from the rear, but also it retains a lot of the features that we first debuted on the SC5000 and also the SC5000M. So it's a multi-touch, multi-gestural screen. This means we can swipe to load tracks. If we swipe right, we can load it into any of the four decks. But if you swipe left, this loads the track into the prepare panel. And also, it supports multi-gesture commands. This means we can pinch and zoom waveforms and scroll through our crates and playlists. A brand new feature for the Prime 4 is our real-time playlist management. By using the edit tool at the top of the touch screen, we can select multiple tracks and move them around our different playlists and crates. But also, in the edit mode, I can create playlists and playlist folders in real time. From the main screen, I can also engage my record mode. That's very simple. We simply hit record. We can also pause the recording at any time. When we hit save as, we name our file, and our recording is then created in our sessions folder on our engine prime stick. Now, these recorders WAV, and if you are using any of our two microphone inputs, any audio from the mic is also captured on the recording. Microphone connectivity is handled by our two combi Neutric inputs at the rear of the unit. Each mic has its own independent gain and EQ control. Mic 1 has low, mid and high control, while mic 2 has low and high. Also, each microphone has its own dedicated echo on and off switch. Now obviously this is great for any DJs who are doing corporate events or weddings. If the two microphone inputs are being used during the recording, the audio is then captured to the recording. So this is great if the videographer wants to sync up the direct audio later. So track filtering is a big part of the Prime ecosystem. With our touchscreen, we can navigate by BPM, track, genre, artist, and key. Once we've filtered down to those categories, we can then apply a further filter. For example, date added, comment, but also search a particular BPM range, and then filter by genre or key. This means it's incredibly easy and fast to find tracks that you're looking for. One of the most popular features from the SE5000 and the SE5000M is how we handle key lock. And that's also the case with the Prime 4. With key lock engaged, I can perform wide sweeps on the pitch fader without degrading the audio. This means all the bass is retained, all the vocals are intact, and any melodic elements stay in place. With the Prime 4, what's new here? is our real-time key matching and key shifting. If we tap the key icon on the screen, you'll see a dialog box appear at the top of the track. We can then use the plus or minus keys to cycle through different keys of the track, again, in real time. Another brand new feature for the Prime 4 is our real-time key matching. If we hold down the key lock button for two seconds on the opposing deck of the track that is playing, both the track's keys will be matched in real time. Again, non-destructively. The Prime 4's mixer section has been designed from the ground up, but also inherits some features from the X1800. For example, our 14 effects range from echoes, delays, phasers, and flanges, but also our four sweep effects as well. Echo, washout, filter, and noise. The unit 
that I've been using today has a one terabyte SSD drive installed. Once the drive is installed, we can format directly from the Prime 4, but also we can continue to add to our crates and playlist by connecting the Prime 4 to our laptop. In addition to our SATA drive bay installation, media is also handled by our two USB ports at the top, SD card slot, and two USBs at the rear. One of which is labeled specifically for charging tablets or iOS devices. This means if we're running a backup system from a tablet or phone, we don't have to rummage around in the booth looking for a power supply. We can simply connect this to the USB port at the rear of the Prime 4. Another feature that's been retained from the SC5000 and the SC5000M is our emergency track. This means if a stick is accidentally pulled, the entire track is cached into the RAM. But also, the track can still be manipulated using our roll feature, beat jump, and also any jog wheel manipulation. One of the great things about the Prime ecosystem is how we can pull from different music library sources. For example, in our Engine 1.2 update, we also included Tractor Library import. Now in Engine Prime, we can also import from iTunes and Serato, but also, like the SC5000 and the SC5000M, we can use record box sticks in conjunction with the Prime 4. Once a record box stick is inserted and a track is loaded, the Prime 4 will then begin analyzing the music. When the analysis process is complete, you'll be given full beat grid, BPM, and key information. Analysis is a one-time only process, so there'll be no need to reanalyze a track once you load it into another deck. So one of the really great practical features of the Prime 4, which will appeal to many pro mobile DJs, is our Zone Out. Now with Zone Out, we're able to send an independent playlist to a separate room. So a great example of this would be if you were playing at a corporate event or a wedding, and you wanted to send some music to a reception area, a bar area, or a terraced area. We simply hit Zone Out, select a playlist, tap Send to Zone, and the playlist then plays in sequential order. Control over the Zone Out playlist is handled by a dedicated gain and EQ settings at the top of the unit. Another great feature for mobile DJs is our Stage Link protocol. With our built-in Cat5 connection, we can run the Prime 4 in conjunction with any of our lighting software partners. This includes Timecode, Resolume, and Sound Switch. Mapping the Prime 4 to our lighting software can be as simple or as complex as you choose. So not only is the Prime 4 a fantastic solution for mobile DJs with its rugged build quality and groundbreaking features, it also serves as a fantastic introduction to the Prime ecosystem. Sure.